Hey guys, hi, welcome back. So today we will talk about idioms. I know a lot of you love to use idioms. It's great to use one or two appropriate ones in your IELTS writing section or speaking section. Please be careful that you use them in the relevant area. Okay, so let's talk about idioms. I'm going to tell you some interesting hand-picked idioms which you can use in your daily walk of life, in your IELTS exams as well, in job interview or pretty much anywhere. So idioms, as you all know, are a group of English words or phrases which should not be considered literally, right? So we should always focus on the metaphorical meaning of it. So what message does it convey or what is the correct usage of that phrase is where the focus should be rather than the actual words in that phrase. Let me give you a quick example. So it's raining cats and dogs. It does not mean that cats and dogs are falling from the sky. It means that it's raining heavily. It's raining cats and dogs. It's raining heavily. Let's see the next idiom. High as a kite. It does not mean that you're actually flying high in the sky. It means that you are on drugs or you are actually sensing the feeling of it. So you are high as a kite. The next idiom is over the moon. I'm sure you've heard this before. Over the moon. It basically means overjoyed, thrill, really happy. So when would you be over the moon? I was over the moon when I got eight bands in English speaking test. Or I was over the moon after securing that job. Over the moon. Right? So let's move on to the next idiom. A drop in the ocean. It means a very tiny bit of something really big. So there's an ocean and a drop in it. A drop in the ocean. Just learning these idioms is like a drop in the ocean when it comes to preparing for your IELTS test. Okay, so a drop in the ocean. So let's see the next idiom. Put all your eggs into one basket. It basically means putting all your efforts, energy, everything you have into just one particular thing. Put all your eggs into one basket. Do not put all your eggs into one basket, but apply for multiple universities. Right? It means just don't apply for one. Don't put all your energy, effort and money for one. In fact, apply for multiple, spread it across. Put all your eggs in one basket. This one is one of my favorites. And that is the real McCoy. The real McCoy. It means something which is genuine, which is not fake, actual, original, genuine, as I said, the real McCoy. These pearls are the real McCoy. This means these are genuine, right? So try using this from now on, the real McCoy. Let me know what sentences can you make with this. The next idiom is run of the mill. Run of the mill. It means quite ordinary, average. The sentence would be smartphones are really run of the mill these days. Don't you think so? Let me know. The next idiom is down in the dumps. It means to be really sad, grieved. I was down in the dumps when my dog died. So down in the dumps, to be sad. The next idiom is go the extra mile. It means to do something much more than is required. Go the extra mile. She decided to go the extra mile and learn swimming in order to teach her son. Go the extra mile. Well, the next idiom is a hot potato. Hot potato. It means something which is controversial. 
Topics related to politics are hot potatoes in my nation these days. Well, that's all my dear. So I have covered multiple idioms. Please have a look at it, learn from it. And yes, I have made a playlist with numerous other idioms. Yes, the videos which I've done on the other idioms, it's right here. You can click this playlist and see all the videos, learn more idioms and increase your vocabulary bank. That's all. Like, share, subscribe and comment. You are my rock star and you will be a champion soon. Till then, I'll see you around. Bye-bye. Happy practicing.